And if it gets in your wrinkles like that, you just keep pushing it around. You just want to blend, 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 blend to where you get really uniform colors that you want. And see how underneath the eyebrow, like that looked really white and scary, like it was too much. Do you see now how it blends together? And this, that's what creates those layers upon layers upon layers, but it's what gives you that dimension. And I keep it pretty simple, but it doesn't get much better than this. So we're going to do this lip liner and you see how I have a little bit of foundation on my lips. Same idea here, you guys. It gives you that dimension. It gives you something for your lip liner and your lipstick to grab onto. Um, and it makes it pop. So much more. If I didn't have that concealer on my lips, you would barely be able to see this lip liner. Okay? And you just want to really gently go around the edges. I have pretty thin lips, so it's really cool. This is a trip I did or a trick I did learn. You kind of pop up a little bit. Right on either side of the lip, I like to just bring it straight from the nostril down. 